What's good everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. It's your boy Jonas here and today guys we are now gonna hop back into some more boondocks. Woo! Last episodes of the boondocks were so funny man. I really enjoyed both of them. We had an episode where the family went to a garden dinner party held by uh, the guy that owns their house and then we had the episode with R. Kelly. Dude that R. Kelly episode was fucking wild bro. It's so wild but I love this show man. It's so funny. I really want to do more episodes so let's hop in some more. Here we go. My grandfather, Robert Jebediah Freeman, Robert after Freeman. a lifetime of odd adventures and strange yeah. mishaps, mm -hmm. decided to spend his last days in the warm embrace of suburbia. But he was still searching for his perfect woman. Ah, uh, he's still for looking for his reason? the one. I have no idea. Enhance, enhance, enhance. Je Jesus, man. Je oh my God. Damn. Oh my god, that kid, bro. This kid, man. No, 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 no. He sure looks like a handful. Uh huh. When he gets like this, I just don't know how to make him stop. Oh my god. Yeah, beat his ass. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, she. He te see, Granddad teaching the way. He needed that ass beating. I'm sorry. Damn. Okay. Okay. Hey, 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 well, baby girl, uh, baby girl. <laughs> I guess I just hate to see a child go unbeaten. House of Cheeks. Mm. I'm Crystal. Yeah. Like the champagne? I'm Granddad. Oh, Crystal, that's like champagne. Hello, cutie. Yeah. <laughs> I'd rather not. Yeah. My name's Krista. Like the champagne. Like the champagne. Like the champagne. Well, that sounds like a stripper name. Mm -hmm. Might you be a stripper? <laughs> Is she? What do you know about strippers, little man? Mm. Not much, but I do know they're usually named after liquor. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Hey, hey. Stop. Stop, Check bro. Stop. Check out this special French whipped cream. Mmm. 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 Yeah. Mm. 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 Okay. Incredible. Yeah, yeah. Green, green, teddy bear. Honey. Mm. Mm. A lot of veggies. A lot of. <laughs> Somebody's busy. God damn. $53.12 is your total. Will this be cash or charge? I saw a lot of Trojans in there. Jesus. She might be a stripper. You're such a gentleman. You didn't have to carry all my bags. Huh. It's my pleasure. Well, see you around. Damn, damn, she's pretty fine, but I think she might be a stripper. Who buys that many fucking boxes of Trojans? I Jesus. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if. Would you like a date? It just so happened I have coupons for the Red Lobster Cutie Pie. Mm, okay, um, okay. Okay. Granddad, granddad, granddad. He's too nice. He's too nice. Do realize that light skinned hoe was a hoe. <laughs> right, granddad? <laughs> Don't cuss, boy. Now watch your mouth. <laughs> I didn't cuss. I said ho. I don't see what the big deal is. <laughs> Just saying ho. Jesus. Chill, chill, chill. No. Here's a ho, though. I bet you won't say it again. Ho. Oh, watch the roll. Watch the roll, granddad. <laughs> Jesus. Have you asked she yourself a why a twenty-year-old girl would want to go out with the man your age? Mm -hmm. Because I laid my game down quite flat. Hey, he got dripped game? though. Game? What you know about the game, Granddad? Yeah, Granddad. Taking women out to eat, giving them free meals. What part of the game is that? <laughs> you taking her to Red Lobster mm -hmm. with the cheddar biscuits? Mm. The fam ain't eating mm. cheddar biscuits, but I want Red Lobster too, man. That sounds pretty good right now. Your Granddaddy knows the game. Do you know game? game recognize game, Granddad. Recognize game. Your granddaddy recognize you really game. game. Game recognize game, and you looking kind of unfamiliar right now. I, I can't. Where's granddad? <laughs> Can I help you, sir? I ain't got time to mess around with y'all. I got a date. Get out the way. This is funny, bro. This is funny. Don't granddad. do it, granddad. Don't feed her. Come on, now. <laughs> don't feed her, bro. She is a hoe, man. I'm sorry. Or a stripper. What is? What does she even do? I'm pretty sure we'll get a backstory mm. with her or whatever she is. Oh God, God damn! Mm. Hey, hey, chill, man. Mm. It's gonna be TOS for YouTube. We're gonna have my so video. Good. Wow, mm -hmm. I've never seen a woman eat like that, or a man actually. Yeah. <laughs> you should bring some home for the boys. Yeah. Well, I don't know. If you feed them, they'll never leave. Oh, stop! Hey, man, the animators did a good job well, though. I'll give you that. Animators did a good <laughs> job. 
You should let me babysit sometimes. Mm. Doggy bag? A doggy bag is 90 bucks. A tea bag is 50. But I have to ask you to excuse me right now. See, I'm kind of, you know, on a real date. Oh, so she's an escort. Yeah, she's now an escort. That I think about it, I don't ever remember seeing Granddad with a woman. There was a time when I was three when I thought he was gay. But now I think it's just bad luck. I don't see what the big deal is with hoes anyway. Right? <laughs> like in you. women and not hoes. <laughs> not Riley, sorry. 20, I get confused. 25 percent That's Riley. Okay. But if they not all hoes, then why I got to pay to take them out to eat You then? just got to. I mean, I'm paying. That's payment. Because that's just what you do. <laughs> yeah. You meet a girl. You take her out to dinner. But yes. You're not paying the girl. You're paying the restaurant. Exactly. But I'm paying. Why don't I just give her the money I was going to spend on dinner? And that hoe can go grocery shopping. <laughs> you know, hey, Riley kind of speaking facts a little, a little bit, a little bit. Might as well just make dinner at home. Sales. Okay. I don't really like to talk about work. I'm not really fulfilled at my job. Why not? You're well, an escort. Wrong, or would Riley say a hoe? And the clients, <laughs> basically, I'm in a transitional period. <laughs> Like last year, people said I should be a model. How come Granddad but not here with these men are saying in the background? Do that whole thing? I wish I could find a man who could swoop in like a superhero and save me from, you know, work. Mm. Kind of like a Captain Saver me. Captain Saver Do you know where I can buy a cake? <laughs> damn. I see everybody like, damn, bro. That's how it starts, you know. Taking bitches out to eat. <laughs> Meals and whatnot. Riley. And you know. You're jumping to conclusions. It's yeah. just a date. What if yeah. he marries her? What if we end up with a hoe for a grandma? Oh my God! Riley, shut your dumb <laughs> ass up. What if we have a hoe for a grandma and she comes to school on career day? Oh my God! Ooh. What if they have hey, but kids? speaking facts though. We have a brother or sister that's half hoe. <laughs> hey boy. Hey. I love this place. Damn, bro, I they made her fine. Her I'm it. sorry. Hey, I'm Is sorry, but she fine. Eat? I didn't want to believe Riley. I wanted Granddad to have finally found love in But Granddad life. found a hoe. But I've never been one to ignore the obvious. Granddad was trying to turn a hoe into a house. <laughs> oh, you my God. Me, girl. Come on, Granddad. What you talking about? <laughs> you just wait Ooh, a minute. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hey, the Patreon, guys. Can't play a song. Oh, my God, Granddad. You're being used bad. Bad. I feel bad for What's Granddad. Why you keep doing the same move? Where your game at? Where your game at? Where your game at? My ex button ain't working. Mm. I'm Chris Dow, bitch. Who's next? Like the champagne. Fake ass Mariah Carey. <laughs> Ooh, that's how nasty my game is, son. I see niggas running away. Mm hmm. <sighs> A full day supply of vitamin um. C. Oh, no. Yeah, burn that shit. Thanks, dude. We burn that fucking shit. Granddad, that woman has got to go. Mm hmm. Ms. Crystal is my beautiful baby boo, and you mm. will show her some respect. Granddad, we don't know anything about Ms. Crystal. Yeah. I mean, we know she spends all your money. Yes, we know, we know she that for sure. In a black hole. Mm -hmm. We know she cheated PlayStation. Yeah, Ms. G, PlayStation. Live? What does she do for a living? She's in sales. <laughs> Wholesale. <laughs> Granddad, does she duck under the table every time a dude in a purple suit walks in? Oh. Is that her pimp? Oh, that might be her pimp. Uh, a lot of people do that. Mm -hmm. Can she run really, 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 really fast in high heels? I don't know. <laughs> Average speed, I guess. Race you to the car. <laughs> okay. Ugh. God damn, she was fast. <laughs> Maybe a little uh, above average. Mm. Does she keep asking if you're a cop? No. You know, you have to tell me if you're a cop or it's entrapment. Oh mm -hmm. my God. Come oh, on, Granddad. The signs are there, bro. They're there. How does he not see it? Boys don't He's in love, man. Crystal, like I do. She's a wonderful woman. She's in my heart. And for your information, yeah. children, I had relations with Crystal last night. <laughs> Ew, God. Oh, God, man. Yeah, man. He's probably caught a disease that? by now. She didn't charge me a dime. Mm -hmm. You ready to go shopping again? Bro. You betcha. <sighs> granddad, my granddad. Come on, man. The signs are there. What did Huey say? You can't turn a hoe into a housewife. Hey, Huey. Okay, Crystal. 
I think we need to talk. I just want to tell you how much fun it's been hanging out with you guys. Mm. Think of me as the big sister you always wanted. <laughs> Don't take this no. the wrong way, yeah. but I need you to get the hell up out of here. <laughs> Any particular Don't have to say it. You're kind of a lazy hoe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can see that. I don't know why my granddad can't see it. Because he's an idiot. To be honest, he's kind of old me too. either. It's so obvious. I know. But it's okay because, see, I'm in this transitional I, 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 period. I don't care. You got to go. You got to go, man. You're just here for the money and for the glamour. I can't do that. I'm sorry. Why? You guys have the life. And I want the life, too. Yeah, but it's our yeah, life. Yeah, you're We're not even providing family. anything. Oh. So now we get to what this is really about. Yeah. I'm not one of y'all. I'm not in the family. I don't care <laughs> his genes. So I have to go? Yes. Uh, yeah. Plus you're a lazy hoe. There you go. A Plain simple. Term. Right now I'm somewhere between anatomical sales or something. Are you even wearing underwear? And I made this girlfriend. <laughs> Can't you be positive about my growth? No. Crystal, you gotta go. part of you being here is unacceptable. Mm -hmm. Do you realize I'm doing prostitute laundry? <laughs> Do you have any idea how disgusting? Touching thongs, bras, and stuff. Look, you can't get rid of me. Yeah. I can do things to persuade your granddad that you can't do. Like no, what? Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. Don't ask, don't ask, don't ask. Mm -hmm. I was going about this the wrong way. Yeah. Granddad needed to see the truth for himself. You gotta show the truth. Oh my god, there he is, the pimp. Oh, damn. Yep. She's a hoe. Come on, Granddad. What is this? That's not me. Yep. I can't believe you would digitally alter pictures of me. Boy, that ain't nothing but Photoshop. Get that out of here. Granddad, come on, dude. <laughs> oh man, them fake ass crocodile like tears. Me. Haven't I done enough for you two? Mm. Y'all don't know what it's like to be old. This bitch. To know you don't have many days left. Crystal makes me happy. Why? But she's but using you. you. Take that away from me. I'm getting irritated by this bitch. Sorry. It's the nigga in a purple suit. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? Is it okay? Who so are it's, you? that's the pimp. My name is a pimp named Slickback. Oh, Slickback. I believe I may have misplaced some merchandise is that in Williams? this residence. <laughs> There she is. Oh my god. Bitch, I hope you got the money to cover this little vacation you've been taking. Oh. Now hold up, Slickback. No, that's a pimp named Slickback. Yeah. That's what Let's I say. Slickback. Slickback. No, no, it's a pimp named Slickback. Okay. Like a tribe called Quest. You say the whole thing. A pimp named Slickback. A pimp named Slickback. Can we call you Slickback for short? No, nigga. I'm a pimp <laughs> named Slickback. You gotta say Crystal, the full name. A pimp named Slickback. Nigga, are you deaf? I'm a pimp named Slick Back. Say yeah. it with me now. He's my pimp. Your pimp? Come on, Granddad. So Put it together. Really are, uh, uh, yes, she's I'm a, a hoe. <laughs> Come on, bitch, now. Finally, dude. Pimp named Slick Back. Could I please have a minute? Yeah. A minute? <laughs> Let us pray the pimp's prayer. Lord, the please pray for the soul of this bitch and guide my pimp hand and make it strong, Lord. Amen. Oh. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Oh. Is that granddad? You ain't gonna hit yeah. no woman in my Ooh. house. What woman, sir? This here is a hoe. Not in this house, she's not. Wah, 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 wah. Indiana Jenkins. I didn't know we were still <laughs> whooping niggas. <laughs> Bitch, you got 45 seconds and I'm leaving. Mm. 44. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. I mean, at first I thought you knew. Yeah, I thought he would have known. How would I? I mean, I don't see how you couldn't have known. Yeah. Well, I thought I knew from a mile away. I mean, there were so many obvious signs. Right, There's right, condoms, right, the, the vegetables, the pictures. Crystal, Come on, man. You've done in the past as long as you're ready to start fresh. <laughs> Think about it. You can stay here. Maybe get a job. Go back to school. Yeah. I'm not really cut out for school and jobs. But you'll be you can do to it. stay here with us. And yeah. You'll, you'll have a home. You're right. That sounds nice. Let me just go and get rid of a pimp named Slickback. Then maybe I'll get some applications. <sighs> Eleven. Ten. <laughs> nine. He's still counting. You're coming back, right? Of Come course. on, Granddad. Thanks for trying to save me. No, Daddy, wait, wait! wait 
And then her stupid ass is still going back to that guy. She'll be back. Grand oh my god, granddad. Honestly, I feel sorry for him because I get it. He's in love guess, with this deep person. Down, all grown ups want to find that perfect person that'll guarantee that they'll never be lonely again. Mm -hmm. I still believe granddad will find this someday. Oh, man. Did she come back? Don't blow out the candle. She'll think nobody's home. It's all right, granddad. It's, it's okay, man. Maybe she'll be back tomorrow. She'll find, she'll find somebody else, man. One that bitch is a hoe. Damn, she's fast. <laughs> run, bitch, run. <laughs> she That's sure funny. can run in those heels. I know. I can't get no real job. You had the opportunity. <laughs> Feel the burn. <laughs> Woo, okay, so what did I think of this episode? Ah, not gonna lie. I kind of feel sorry for Granddad, man, because I could tell he really loved Cristal Champagne, but dude, <laughs> bro, she was a hoe from the start. I mean, granted, Granddad's a little bit old, so he probably didn't know, but uh, the signs were there. Even Huey and Riley saw them. They're like kids, but fuck, dude, I feel sad. Also, like, too, they got a lot of the cameo for Cat Williams for the appendix in the back. I feel bad for Granddad. I really do. You know, he thought he found himself a good, you know, girl, but it turns out this trifling Cristal chick was a fucking hoe. Uh, but yeah, episode was great, so let's hop next one. Here we go. Again, solid animation. I really love it. Ooh. Ooh. Watch where you walking, nigga. Hey, hey, what you say, nigga? Uh oh. Watch closely. You're about to experience a nigga moment. <laughs> oh, oh my god. As a moment when ignorance overwhelms the mind of an otherwise docile Negro male. What did you say, bitch? Man? Where do they get the machine guns? Hey, please, it, nigga? Causing him to act in an illogical, oh my god, bro. I.e., like a nigga. Oh my god. <laughs> Nigga moments are unpredictable. Yeah. Hey, wait, man, wait. This is stupid. Hey, you right, dog. Look, let's put the guns away and go on about our business. Yeah. Oh. If they had their own category, Nigga moments would be the third leading killer of black men behind pork chops <laughs> and FEMA. It's a fact. What's FEMA? Now let's see how a Nigga moment affects a white man. Okay. Watch where you walking, bitch. What did you what? wait a minute? <laughs> I'm white. <laughs> <laughs> Where you going? Hey. Don't you ignore me. A big hey, he walked away. Good for him. <laughs> is that it can be avoided by simply moving away from niggas. If only it were that easy. <laughs> See, niggas always got a new trick right around the corner. Ooh. Oh shit. Always taking two lanes. I was like, what? I see him going straight. Listen up, boys. I'm about to sing the new shoe song. New shoes? New shoes. New shoes. <laughs> I miss John with this one, bro. Make some good shoes. Ave Maria. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, I know, man. What the hell? Hold on, every nigger moment begins with the nigger without that Colonel H. Stinkman. All you're left with is peace and quiet. Colonel H. Stinkman is and always has been a cantankerous, ornery old man. Okay, he spent his childhood disagreeing with most things, especially things involving happiness. Unity and kindness. Okay. Stink Mina got no pleasure seeing sunsets and trees, mm -hmm. dolphins and rainbows. This some more bullshit. <laughs> so he didn't particularly mind when at age 15 he lost his sight to cancer. Oh. At least I don't have to look at your glass no more. The doctors gave him three years to live. So he dedicated those three years to spreading a lifetime. Oh my God! He became a menace. He believed it was his love of hatred that kept him going. Mm, Who in the hell maybe. <laughs> in my face? That's like calling 1 800 collecting ass whooping. And no, that ain't no toll free call. Partner, you hit my car. I know, bro. Are you blind? Yeah. Yes, I am. So, yeah. wait, you're blind? Yes. Blind. Why is he driving a car? You got a problem with that, nigga? <laughs> oh, look what you my did. damn, destroy that car good. Fuck. You better have. Insurance. Yeah. Nigga, you better have insurance. Ass whooping insurance. 
and you about to pay a deductible. And just Ooh. like that, my granddad was trapped in a nigger moment. <laughs> At this point, he can A, walk away and let insurance handle the damage to the car. Yeah. Or B, fight with a dumb, crazy blind man. <laughs> Let's see which one he chooses. Pick A, granddad. <laughs> What you gonna do? Oh. What you gonna do? What you gonna do, granddad? Oh, hell no. He's spinning your face, too. Let's whoop this nigga's ass right Beat him here. up. Let's go. You wanna do something? <laughs> Bitch ass knuckle. Dude, he's Fuck in up. his face. I smell new shoes. Oh, me. Oh. <gasps> oh. You don't do that. You don't do that. Oh, my God. 5% of those are sneakers. Boom. Nikes never get stepped on. Granddad beat his ass. Get him, Granddad. Ooh. Oh. 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 Nice job, Riley. Sorry, Huey. I gave him confusion. Sorry. Good job, Huey. At least you protected him. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't believe you got your ass kicked by a blind man, granddad. My knee went up. You yeah. Know, bad knee. Bad knee? That nigga had bad eyes. Good <laughs> thing, granddad. He beat you like a beaten yada. Dude. <laughs> Come on, Riley. Don't be don't be punking on your granddad. He does that too. I must be blind too, because I show to see that ass was coming. Boy. Riley, stop, man. How bad you gotta telegraph your purchase for a blind nigga to see him coming, Granddad. Riley, the man mm. obviously had a heightened sense of hearing. Yeah. I thought Granddad had a heightened sense of falling. No, that's enough. Now yeah. You stop laughing at your Granddaddy. You know, yeah, you man. You. Granddaddy had hit me written down his forehead and brain. Riley, bro, stop. stop. Okay. What you gonna do? Beat me? Maybe <laughs> I can get a blindfold first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you fucked up, Riley. Wait, maybe he gonna fall on me. <laughs> Riley, stop. I know, man. Granddad, Rodney King just called. <laughs> said, Damn, I thought I got my ass whooped. <laughs> Dude, stop punking your granddad. He's already embarrassed him as it is. Ooh. Hey, whoa, 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 what's this transition? Hold on, hold, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I like this. Is that RZA? Or from the Wu-Tang? Is that is the Wu-Tang? i never heard of this song. It's bopping. This is sick. Make them to, oh, it is anime. Make them to action anime. He's sick. Come on, Riley. Fuck him up. Sorry, right, Huey. I keep saying it's Riley. It's Huey. There is no forethought, no logic in his actions. Zenny Swordsman Ooh. This is the blind nigga samurai. What's good, nigga? What's really good? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and in a case mm. of the blind beating the dumb, security cameras from the Woodcrest Square Mall. Ah, oh, they got it on video today. Come on, man. Why the news showing this shit? I know. CNN has now confirmed that it was this man, Robert Jebediah. Ah, <laughs> come on, CNN. A slightly older, significantly blinder gentleman. Police aren't pressing charges against Mr. Freeman. <laughs> they say that ass woman was punishment. <laughs> we at CNN agree. Granddad, I don't think you should watch this. Don't watch the news, man. Ah, uh, not Telemundo. They got it too. Señor Piñata. <laughs> Granddad, you gotta ask yourself, would you really be better off if you had beaten up a blind old man in the street? Doesn't matter, man. You still got beaten up by a blind person. That's more embarrassing. You have reached the Freeman residence. If this is a lovely cutie pie, please leave a message. Everybody else could just hang up right now because I'm not interested. Mm -hmm. Come on, Rob, I pick up the phone. Pick up the phone. <laughs> Uncle I seen you on the news getting your black ass that <laughs> blind old monkey. <laughs> oh my oh, god, Ruckus. Don't you walk away from that family, Jing. <laughs> Granddad, just let it die. I promise he can't, you, man. He can't. You a punk. I will. Well, Riley will. Of course Riley would do it. <laughs> Granddad. Granddad's pissed. He got beat up by a blind person. A blind person. 
That's more embarrassing, dude. And this guy, I don't know how the hell he fucking was able to beat Granddad. Is he gonna do it out again? Hit him, bad. Hit him. Hit him good. Hit him good. I can't believe Granddad went back to fight that man. Yeah. Check this out, Yui. What? Artist of the year. Eat dirt. <laughs> Damn, take a chair right to the face. Aren't you worried about granddad? No, he's not. He's not. He don't give a fuck. <laughs> Riley's fucking menace. Is he back? Did you beat him up? Did you get him, granddad? You don't look hurt. Two weeks. Good for you. A rematch in two weeks. In two weeks? We might be able to make some money off this. The slug fast in Woodcrest. <laughs> yeah, okay. Nice promotion. You don't understand, boy. Mm -hmm. I have to do this. Yeah. Follow me. Where is he taking him? I want you to see what you're up against. The samurai movie? Okay, I can tell that Huey is hella into martial arts, man. He's way into it. Or he's just a fan of it. Jesus. Ooh. I know. Remember the way he dodged the punch? I know. Sadoichi, is that is that really how it is? If you underestimate him, he will kill you. Uh-huh. Ooh. I will fail you. I'm not afraid. Hey. Oh, you will be. You will be. Oh my god. Alright. Gotta get Grand into that training montage. Between me and you, your granddad, it shouldn't be too worried. Everybody knows niggas can't fight. I'm sorry. What? What are you talking about, Ruckus? The best fighters in the world have always been white men. Jack Dempsey, Rocky Marciano, Sylvester Stallone, and don't <laughs> forget Sylvester Stallone. You name me one great black heavyweight fighter. Name one. Go ahead, Ty. Name one. See that you can't do it. Floyd Mayweather, Jackie Robinson. Dude, there's many black fighters. Yeah. That nigga so tough, then why he didn't go to Vietnam? I'll tell you why. Why? He was scared. That's why. Shit. No Vietnamese ever called me nigga. I called him a nigga eight times before I had breakfast. Now what he gonna do? Ruckus, nigga. stop, bro. Stop. It's fools. Ruckus is a fool. He's a fool. He's a fool, bro. I don't understand why I'm blindfolded. Why is Tom blindfolded? The enemy cannot see. But see, the thing is, I don't have super hearing. Yeah. So get why, I'm why is he doing it? <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't have been Huey. <laughs> he said John Vaughn can't fight. Got out that my granddad was training for a rematch. Mm -hmm. and it quickly became the talk. Oh, damn. Now the whole neighborhood knows. Ooh. That? An exhibition? You need emotional content. Okay. Now, try again. I right, try again. Oh. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Damn it, boy. <laughs> Why is he hitting a tree? Everybody knows niggas climb trees, not kick them. <laughs> I'm like, ruckus. Ooh, this kid, this guy. Mm. I like how Ryan's making money off this. Oh, they're going back to the same spot? No way. The fight had a huge turn -up. Seems like watching niggas act stupid is becoming America's favorite pastime. That's basically YouTube boxing. <laughs> hey, listen up. I'm going to tell y'all one more time. This fight ain't starting till I get $10 from all y'all. <laughs> hey, you. No, nigga, I didn't get yours yet. Give me that. That's <laughs> the difference between private nigga moments and public nigga moments. Oh, my God. Private nigga moments shame you. A public nigga moment shame your whole race. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Let's go. 
It ain't your bitch, nigga. I can smell the bitch in you. <laughs> Thank me, bro. Oh. You must have all time ago, man. Uh oh. Uh. And as I watched Stink Demon move blindly around the room, I had a terrifying realization. What? He wasn't a trained swordsman, and he didn't have super healing. Okay. He was a blind old man who had just gotten lucky. Oh, okay. That's what happened. He touched his pole or his stick and he fell. Okay, that's how I was able to get Granddad. Oh, so Granddad's about to beat his ass. Yeah, okay. Ooh, oh. I mean, it's, uh, uh. Granddad's really beating up a blind old man. Oh my God. You know, we could all be reading a book right now. Oh, right in the face. Oh. Oh. Oh, he killed him. I told you a nigga that black couldn't fight. Good God. So granddad killed somebody. He killed Stink Meter. Oh, damn. That's terrible. <laughs> Oh man, yeah. <laughs> Is that how this fights with a chair? <laughs> As he contemplated spending the remainder of his natural life in prison, uh -oh. Granddad never stopped to realize that he had gotten the respect he so desperately wanted. Yo, that mug killed a blind old man with his bare hands. <laughs> now that's gangsta. That's kind of sad though. Tom and I had gotten the fight license by the state boxing commission at the last minute. Oh, okay. Indemnifying Granddad against Stink Meaner. Okay, death. thank God, thank God, thank still God. Still pretty shook up by the whole thing. Mm. Colonel Stink Meaner had no family and no friends. He lived a life without love or companionship Damn. or even pets. Damn. He was a horrible, awful human being, mm -hmm. and in truth, the world was better off with him dead. Yeah. Still. He was our brother. Why'd you say us? You killed him. No, why'd you say us? <laughs> True, Granddad's the one that killed him. Jesus. Wow. Well, well, woo! Okay, so what did I think of this episode? Uh, wow. Okay, it was great. I liked it. It was a very, very interesting episode that we had a blind person take on Granddad and then to find I really thought this dude was like maybe he had he just had good senses like Huey said. Turns out that he got a lucky win that he uh, Granddad stepped on his pole or started stick and got a good hitting. But fuck dude. Granddad basically beat up a, bl a blind old man, especially Stink Meter dude. Like I mean Snake Meter was a hateful guy, let's be honest here. He didn't give a fuck about anybody. <laughs> but Jesus, Granddad didn't have to kill him. <laughs> Honestly, the episode was good. I did love it. I loved how, like, you know, they were setting up a training montage with Granddad, and also they had something going on with, uh, they don't have so much of Snake Meter training. Then again, too, he was not really fine because he was blind. <laughs> uh, but yeah, man, damn, this episode was, was kind of sad because Granddad just killed somebody. But yeah, man, episodes are great. I really enjoyed them for the most part. And if you've not seen them, please go check them out. Much I want to thank you all for watching this video. If you like, please don't like, favor, and subscribe. I will be doing more reactions in the future. So if you have anything you want to check out in the future, but leave them in the comment section down below. But uh, yeah, this has been your boy Jonas, and I'll see you all later.